How has uh, practice been for you this week and uh, and being able to have uh, two weeks to prepare for Wisconsin? Good to see you, Ken. Um, practice week's been, uh, last two weeks have been good. Um, anytime you can get that week out extra to recover, recover from injury, a lot of guys coming back. Um, I feel like we had two good weeks of practice and I feel like we should be prepared for Saturday. Well, obviously, uh, if you, you know, the uh, Wisconsin uh, last week, 24 to nothing over Illinois, they ran for 391 yards uh, in the game. Uh, what, what did you see in, uh, in that game on uh, offense? They certainly show they can run the ball. Yes, they certainly can. Um, I think that's going to be our number one priority, just stopping the run, trying to get them in some second and longs, third and longs, to be able to try and get them off the field. But that's going to have to be our main priority, um, forcing them to pass the ball. Yeah, any any of the offensive performers for uh, Wisconsin stand out? Their quarterback, Graham Mertz, uh, uh, got two running backs, uh, Lucy and Allen both ran for 100, over 100, 130 yards with a touchdown. Anything that stands out in their offense? Uh, they all look pretty impressive on film. Um, quarterback looks good. and Running backs can definitely run the ball. Um, and then the offensive line is uh, pretty big, so it should present a challenge for us, and we're excited to get after it. Abby? Hi, Andre. This is Abby with uh, Spectrum News. So I have a few questions regarding um, some current stats that you've been racking up so far this season. Uh, you're currently, you probably don't focus on this right now, but you're currently leading the nation in sacks or tied for first. Um, so I guess I have a few questions. First of all, what is your main focus when you're going into practice, going into game week? What kind of sets you apart to be quicker off the line and stuff like that that uh, makes you successful? I would say Coach Woody does a great job working with um, us during pass rush, making sure we know what we're looking at from the uh, offensive tackle, making sure that we get a good get off and just keep uh, adding moves that we can work every week um, and just continue to get better with it. Is there anything uh, you're specifically looking forward or looking for in this weekend's game against Wisconsin with the quarterback specifically? Um, I know. You know we feel like they're gonna, um, they're a pretty big running team, it looks like. So we're uh, gonna try to stop that the best we can. And if we can do that, hopefully get them in some second and longs, third and longs. I feel like we'll be uh, successful defensively. And so I, I realize Army football is not an individualistic program. You guys inherently um, are more of a brotherhood, even so than normal. But uh, what do your teammates, how do they help you? Uh, kind of rack up the numbers that you've gotten so far this season? Uh, it's a team effort. Um, nobody can go out there and do it by themselves. Um, when we're rushing the passer, and you got to create that pocket, keep the quarterback in the pocket. So um, no one person can do it by themselves, offense, defensive, uh, special teams. So it's definitely a collective effort out there. And then um, I'm curious about uh, you when you were younger. Was there a specific rusher that you ever watched growing up is there someone you watch on Sundays that you kind of try to channel when it comes to your game? Uh, yeah, what are your thoughts on that? Um, growing up, I didn't even really, I didn't play defense. I played receiver, so I didn't really pay attention to anything like that growing up. But I would say now, a lot of guys, I kind of like like to look at some of the guys in the NFL, Miles um, Garrett, um, uh, Joey Bosa, uh, Khalil Mack, guys like that, just to kind of see what moves that they're doing to get, be successful and kind of see how I can add some of those things in my game. So you just told me you uh, switched to the other side of the ball. What does that say about your athleticism to be this successful at a, a fairly new position for you? Um, I think it's just a blessing uh, from God just to be able to go out there and play wherever I'm, wherever the coaches need me to play, just go out there and do my best. Okay, uh, that's everything I have. Thanks so much, and best of luck this weekend. Thank you, ma'am. Any other questions? Andre, just, yeah, just, I was just going to ask Andre, uh, we look at the uh, offensive line for Wisconsin. Uh, they seem to be all 6'4", over, and around 300 pounds. Uh, I mean, you've played some big offensive lines before, but what kind of what do you see in their offensive line that stands out? Um, like you said, they all look pretty big. Um, on tape, you can see them great with the communication, and kind of like picking up um, blitzes and things of that nature. 
And they also do a great job running the ball. So anytime you can do that, that's going to set up uh, success in the passing game, I feel like. So it should be a great challenge for us. And just, uh, I always like to hear about your partnership with Eric Smith, uh, uh, at the, the, your, the two inside linebackers, and uh, uh, you give Army a lot of strength up the middle. Uh, how is it working with Eric and preparing for a big game like this? It's great working with Eric because you know that he's going to prepare himself um, in the film room. He probably watches the most film out of anybody I've seen on the team. And then when you get out there on the field, you know that he's going to make all the tackles up the middle. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen a better play with a better tackler. And the way he just hits people and knocks people back is pretty amazing. So it's definitely great to play with them. And just a key for you and for the defense to uh, play well <laughs> against Wisconsin on Saturday. Biggest key I'll say is stop the run because if we can uh, stop the run, they're not going to have to throw it. So it'll be a bad day for us if we're just getting the ball just run down our throats like that. So 